Juana Radu, a Romanian singer known for her powerful voice, bravely shared her personal struggles. On the talk show, 40 Questions with Denise Rife, she opened up about the dark side of her past relationships. Radu revealed a history of experiencing violence. She spoke about the pain of enduring abuse in multiple relationships. Radu's courage to speak out is commendable. By sharing her truth, she chipped away at the stigma. She encouraged others to seek help. Her story resonated with viewers. Radu's experiences with toxic relationships weren't random. She traced them back to her childhood. Unresolved trauma, particularly abandonment and violence within her family, played a significant role. This cycle of toxicity is a common trap. Breaking free requires awareness, courage, and often professional help. By understanding the root of the problem, we can start to heal. It empowers us to make different choices. Juana Radu's decision to end her marriage was a turning point. It marked the beginning of her healing journey. She finally confronted the fear of abandonment that had haunted her. This breakthrough allowed her to start making healthier choices. Radu discovered the transformative power of therapy. She openly admitted to regretting not seeking help sooner. Therapy provided her with a safe space to process her trauma. It equipped her with the tools to break free from toxic patterns. Therapy is not a sign of weakness. It's an act of courage. It's about investing in our well-being. Radu's story underscores the importance of seeking professional guidance. A therapist can provide support, insights, and strategies for healing. Healing from trauma is not linear. It's a process with ups and downs, Radu's vulnerability reminds us that it's okay to ask for help. It's okay to not be okay. The journey of healing is ultimately about self-discovery, self-compassion, and self-love. Juana Radu's struggles extended beyond relationships. She also battled with her weight. She spoke candidly about her complicated relationship with food. Food became her coping mechanism, a way to numb the pain of loneliness and unhappiness. Emotional eating is a common struggle. We often turn to food for comfort when we're feeling stressed, anxious or sad. Radu's honesty sheds light on this often hidden issue. It's a reminder that we're not alone in our struggles with food. Radu's emotional eating eventually led to weight gain. She reached 120 kilograms approximately 265 pounds. Her story highlights the complex interplay between food, emotions, and overall well-being. It's not just about calories in and calories out. Addressing emotional eating requires a holistic approach. We need to identify the root causes of our eating habits. Therapy, mindfulness, and developing healthier coping mechanisms are all crucial steps. Radu's story encourages us to be kind to ourselves as we navigate this complex relationship with food. Section 5. A Dramatic Transformation The Weight Loss Journey Despite facing setbacks, Awana Radu embarked on a weight loss journey. She lost 52 kilograms, which is approximately 115 pounds, in just eight months. Her dramatic transformation was inspiring. She achieved this through a strict high-protein diet. Radu's dedication was admirable. She showed incredible willpower and discipline. Her story resonated with many struggling with their weight. It offered a glimmer of hope and possibility. However, she also acknowledged the downsides of her approach. The restrictive nature of her diet took a toll on her health. It wasn't sustainable in the long run. Radu's experience serves as a cautionary tale. While quick results can be tempting, they often come at a cost. 
Sustainable weight loss is a marathon, not a sprint. It requires patience, consistency and a balanced approach. Radu's story reminds us to prioritise our health over rapid results. Section 6. The price of quick fixes. The downside of restrictive diets. Awana Radu's restrictive diet came with consequences. Depriving herself of essential nutrients led to health issues. She experienced anxiety, panic attacks and an unhealthy obsession with food. The restrictive nature of the diet backfired. It created intense cravings and a sense of deprivation. This led to a vicious cycle of restriction and binge eating. Radu's experience highlights the dangers of extreme dieting. Restrictive diets often promise quick results. However, they can be detrimental to our physical and mental health. They can disrupt our metabolism, lead to nutrient deficiencies, and trigger disordered eating patterns. Radu's story encourages us to rethink our approach to weight loss. Sustainable change requires a balanced and holistic approach. It's about nourishing our bodies with whole foods, listening to our hunger cues, and prioritizing our well being. Section 7 Embracing a Holistic Approach to Health. Through her struggles and triumphs, Awana Radu became an advocate for a holistic approach to health. She learned that true health encompasses physical, emotional, and mental well being. She now emphasizes the importance of nourishing both the body and mind. Radu encourages self care, stress management, and a healthy relationship with food. She stresses the importance of seeking professional guidance from registered dietitians and therapists. Her message resonates with many struggling with their weight and body image. A holistic approach to health recognizes that we are not just our bodies. Our emotions, thoughts and beliefs all play a role in our overall well-being. Radu's story inspires us to prioritize self-care, stress management and mindful eating. Sustainable change requires addressing the root causes of our health challenges. It's about creating a lifestyle that supports our physical, emotional and mental well-being. Section 8 The Mind-Body Connection Awana Radu's journey highlights the interconnectedness of emotional well-being and physical health. Her experiences demonstrate how unresolved emotional issues can manifest in unhealthy eating habits and weight fluctuations. Her story is a powerful reminder that we cannot separate the mind from the body. By speaking openly about her struggles with emotional eating, Radu helps to destigmatize this common issue. She encourages others to seek support and address the emotional roots of their eating habits. Her vulnerability paves the way for others to share their stories and seek help. When we neglect our emotional well-being, our physical health often suffers. Stress, anxiety and trauma can lead to inflammation, hormonal imbalances and a weakened immune system. Radu's story reminds us that true health requires addressing both our physical and emotional needs. By prioritizing our emotional well-being, we create a ripple effect that positively impacts our physical health. Therapy, mindfulness, stress-reducing activities, and nurturing our social connections are all essential for cultivating a healthy mind-body connection. Section 9. Awana's Legacy Inspiration and Empowerment